Stick around to learn how industries, AI, and communications cloud can resolve billing disputes faster than ever. Companies have to spend a lot of time dealing with billing inquiries, especially in the communications industry, where there are all kinds of different plans, bundled services, and fees to account for. The billing gets real confusing, real fast, especially for the customer, which is how billing inquiries turn into billing disputes. And those disputes can be extremely time consuming and expensive, so it's crucial to resolve the inquiries before they become disputes. Well, today, I'm gonna show you how you can use Salesforce Communications Cloud and Industries AI to do just that. So let's say you're a customer service rep at Quadstar, a major telecom company. It looks like a customer named Rachel reached out because her bill is higher than usual, like a lot higher. And honestly, she's kind of freaked out about it. When you pull up her record, you see her latest bill, which, okay, wow, she wasn't kidding. Yeah, that's a lot more than usual, but you need some context to see what's going on. Is it a mistake? Is it fraudulent? What's the story here? Now, normally you'd have to switch between multiple systems or have Rachel repeat herself to a different service rep, but now you can resolve this right in the console. Quadstar's admins have already connected your customer data with Data Cloud. So that means you can actually see all the data about this customer, her billing history, usage, open cases, and all of her itemized charges. But how do you know what actually made the bill jump? This will probably take some digging around, right? <laughs> nope. This issue comes up a lot, so your admins already set this up for you. All you need to do is click unexpected bill amount and let Einstein analyze the bill for you. And it looks like we found our culprit. You can see that Rachel made a lot of calls to London this month, which isn't covered in her plan. The customer service rep asks an additional question and checks to see if any of those international calls were to phone numbers associated with her family plan. Hmm. Okay, here it looks like all the calls were the same number, a number that is in her family plan. <laughs> the plot thickens. But it's not such a big mystery after all. It turns out the calls were to her husband who's in London for work right now. And because her current plan doesn't include international calling, those surcharges are piling up higher than the London Eye, which means Rachel's sitting here looking at a big bill while her husband is over there looking at Big Ben. Okay, but what do we do with this info? Because I'm pretty sure Rachel's not going to be happy if you just say, too bad, so sad, you owe us a lot of money. Hey, don't worry, our service rep is on top of it. They are able to change Rachel's plan to one that doesn't cost much more but includes unlimited international calls so they can call each other anytime from anywhere. And based on her customer profile and her upgraded plan, you already have approval to apply it to this billing cycle so she's off the hook for all those charges. Well, that was incredibly easy for the customer service rep, but what about the admin that has to set it all up? Hey, also easy, because Communications Cloud has all these pre-built components, automations, and data models that are ready to be customized for your business processes. Now first, we'll just activate Service Console and the generative AI features in Platform Setup. Then we'll head over to Omni Studio, and Omni Studio has all the building blocks to customize your billing assistant, like Omni Scripts, flex cards, and integration procedures. OmniScripts are especially useful here because you can configure them to direct users through some of these more complex processes. Here are the steps, procedures, and actions that make up this OmniScript. The integration procedure designer has these pre-built components that are used to pull the relevant data together, including the generative AI components we enabled earlier. So then the admin just needs to go to Lightning App Builder drag the OmniScript component onto the page, select the details from the dropdown, and hit save. And boom, your customer service reps are now set up for success. And Rachel, your customer, remember her? She's a happy camper, which is actually a pretty big deal. Like, no, really think about it. At the beginning of this call, she was ready to go off on us over this bill, but now, just a couple minutes later, the rep got her on a new plan, that generates more revenue for the company and more importantly, keeps her happy and loyal, win-win. And that is why we do it, right? For the Rachels of this world. All right, well, that's it for today. To learn more about how Salesforce can help you and your business, click the link on screen. I'll also drop a few resources in the description. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you next time.